Twin Cities Broadcast Center. This is Fox 9 News at 10. I'm to six. A number of roads washed out during the flooding in southeastern Minnesota. But it's making some steady progress with a new and unusual method. Fox 9's Tim Blotz reports. Initially when I saw it, I was pretty excited. Along Highway 14 in Winona County, cars are staying on the road because of what's sticking out of the road. This is inch and a half tubing. Crews here are using steel pipes to physically nail the roadbed back together. Now we've had a custom made tip. We have this milled specially for us. The nails all come after heavy rain swamped Winona County in August. The flooding destroyed homes, washed out roads. MnDOT had to fix them fast. So it hired Tim Rockman. He's a modern-day John Henry with a backhoe and a secret weapon. This is an old military nerve gas launcher. Rockman's Cold War relic. The snails set into this pressure box, if you will. Is now nothing more than a giant air hammer with a lot of power. And it's pretty effective. That launcher shoots these nails into the ground at about 250 miles an hour. It'll catch you off guard if you're not not ready for it. The gun blasts these nails some 15 feet into the ground. It will take several dozen nails to hold this embankment in place, and when done, crews will cut off the excess and encase them in concrete. I've been in the drilling industry myself most of my life, and uh, I've never seen anything that's quite like this. It's a road fix that's quick and effective. A whole new avenue, a whole new way of looking at things, and... Uh, it's pretty exciting to be a part of it, you know. In Stockton, Tim Blotz, Fox 9 News.